So what is up guys welcome to HGT Tech and Motivation YouTube channel and welcome to this new video. So guys in today's video I am very excited to tell you today's video's topic is the iPhone 10 and the iPhone 11. Is the iPhone 11 a upgrade or if you are planning to get a new iPhone and if you are using any older iPhone such as the iPhone 6s or the iPhone 6 then it's de both of these devices are definitely an upgrade for you but it is again obvious that which one to go for. In today's video, I am going to be telling its pros and cons. Today's video is going to be very epic so without any further ado, let's get started. First of all guys, let's start with its display and overall form factor. The iPhone XI first when it was launched in 2018 a year ago it was again people started to raise questions that its display is not at all good it's using a lcd display when it's more premium apple's lineup such as the iphone 10 uh, s and the 10s max were using the oled panels so there were controversies on this iphone you know regarding its specs regarding its display you know 720p panel but later on when people started to use it in daily basis they got that this is definitely an upgrade because you're getting so much and the display is still even a beautiful one the product red finish is really great i definitely love that and i also love the blue color variant and guys now let's talk about its overall form factor it's pretty nice handy it's kind of like uh, the iphone 10 is kind of narrow but this is a lot wider according to my perspective and just it only features one 12 megapixel camera at the rear which is a, a wide angle so when uh, the iphone 10 was out you know iphone 10 and 10 mac didn't have the wide angle uh, lens for portrait okay the iphone 10 was only the device which took like a nice uh, wide angle portrait shots which made it even more popular and now the iphone 11 is in the town and the specifications its features and everything makes us feel to buy it well guys the iphone 11 has a 12 megapixel standard camera and a 12 megapixel wide angle camera so you are not lacking anywhere with the iPhone 11 Pro or the iPhone 11 but you are also there is again a ultra wide angle lens with the iPhone 11 Pro which makes it a pro iPhone but with the iPhone 11 you are still not missing out on much you are getting again like the noise cancellation microphone at the back and a beautiful true tone LED flash you know the quad LED true tone flash and again all of its colors which it comes with all of the 6 color variants all of the palette this time which Apple has used is very subtle and very vibrant so these colors are you know kind of dull but uh, definitely vibrant so I like this palette and but I still miss the blue color from the iPhone 10 it is replaced with the green color variant but I really don't see myself calling the green iPhone 11 really green because it kind of looks like a blue in real life again it matters you know the my uh, way of telling difference and just if you want to see for it's yourself just go ahead if you have any friend using a green iPhone or any other iPhone 11 color go for it and have it in person you know just the personal looks are very different than what we see in photos and videos and again the iPhone 11 has beautiful dual cameras as I said and in the front you're getting a 12 megapixel front camera this time Apple is really focusing a lot on its camera department and the front camera is no exception you know 12 megapixel front camera for an iPhone Phone, it is incredible you're getting you know second generation face ID according to Apple but there is not much difference seen again with the iOS 13.1 beta developer beta update with the iPhone 10 even you get the face ID more faster so definitely that is a nice that is a nice feature that Apple is optimizing its already existing features with software updates and overall the iPhone 11 is one of the greatest build so guys this is it if you want to go for a better deal with a dual camera setup you can definitely go for the iphone 11 and spoiler the iphone 11 is one of the greatest smartphones to go for and you can easily go for that so guys i hope that you have liked today's video in today's video i try to tell you like what are the differences and similarities between the iphone 10 and the iphone 11 and again guys i don't personally own the iphone uh, 10 thanks a lot for itech everything for sharing his video clips and again guys go check his channel out he makes beautiful content regarding iPhones and iOS and uh, yesterday only he made his own tablet so guys it's worthwhile checking his channel out so don't forget to check his channel and subscribe to him and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and guys stay tuned for more videos 